Yo, what's going on YouTube? What's going on everybody? How are you doing out there? Thank you for tuning in today, man. Today we're going to be checking out The Pogues. All right, this is my first time ever listening to this group in my life. I've grown familiar with their name over the past few weeks because on Facebook, uh, they were talking about the singer of this group. Uh, I could tell he was going through some struggles. He was still alive at the point that I saw his name being mentioned. Um, he was sick. Uh, his wife was by his side and he ended up passing um, not too long ago, so I'm familiar with his name and I'm familiar with his group's name just because of that, but I haven't ever heard this group before and I haven't ever heard this song before, so today is my first time checking them out and checking out this song. So this is The Pogues, A Fairy Tale of New York. Now I was fishing for some Christmas-like songs uh, to respond or to react to and give a listen to this time of year and try to get some out uh, on the channel before Christmas so that you guys can, you know, we can have that little bond with this season, man. I thought that would be pretty cool. So I'm trying to get some of these songs out to you guys. This one was highly suggested, The Pogues Fairy Tale of New York. So before we get this started, if you've got some favorites, please list them down below in the comment sections. Let me know some favorite uh, Christmas time songs that you want to see me react to. I will try to get to as many as I can before Christmas, um, but probably just up to Christmas. And I might be putting out one to two a day, and that's going to be about it. So we'll see what we can get checked off the list before Christmas comes, okay? So we got this one right here. Uh, I hear this was a pretty big Christmas song, uh, maybe over in the UK and whatnot. And once we get it playing, we'll see if I've ever heard it um, before. But to my knowledge, uh, no, I haven't. So we're going to check it out um we got a music video right here with it if you guys are unable to see that it's because i pushed it through past the youtube block um but i had to block up the video in order to get it on youtube that would be unfortunate if that's the case but i want these videos to come out before christmas so i might have to do that and i might mention that on all my christmas reactions that have a video included uh, so if you guys aren't able to see the video i'm sorry i just want to push this reaction out so you guys can at least get their reaction okay so let's go ahead and jump into this see what's happening the pogs um sorry the pogs uh fairy tale of new york i had to look up the name and how to say it because i do not i want i don't know pogs okay pogs so let's go ahead and get this plane thank you guys for tuning in here we go Christmas Eve, babe, in the drunk tank, an old man said to me, won't see another one, and then he sang a song, the rare old mountain tear, I turned my face away. And dreamed about you God, I'm the lucky one Came in like ten to one I've got a feeling This year is for me and you So happy Christmas When all our dreams come true Ooh. I was liking what we had before and then this switch they up They got cars big as bars, they got rivers of gold But the wind goes right through you, it's no place for the old When you first took my hand on a cold Christmas Eve You promised me Broadway was waiting for me you were pretty queen of New York City When, when the band, band finished playing They held up for more Sinatra was swinging All the jokes they were singing We kissed on the corner Then danced through the night The boys of the NYPD choir Were singing Go away, babe And the bells were ringing out For Christmas Day Oh yeah, this came alive big time You scumbag, you maggot, cheap, cheap, lousy faggot Tabby Christmas, you're all so I'd break God, it's our love The boys of the NYPD chorus still singing Go away, play And the bells are ringing out for Christmas Day Alright 
some drama on the Christmas song. I could have been someone. Well, so could anyone. You took my dreams from me when I first found you. I kept them with me, babe. I put them with my own. Can't make it all alone. I built my dreams around you. The boys of the NYPD chorus to sing, go away, play. And the bells are ringing out for Christmas Day. You know, these instruments are nice. So the music was very nice. Uh, I enjoyed it at the beginning with the piano playing. Um, I enjoyed it as it sparked up and just got a breath of new life in it. Um, really, it did give you that Christmassy kind of sound uh, with the overall music. The lyrics were very unexpected in the beginning. It sounds like this is a man who's found himself in a hard place um, and he's almost wishing hey, I, I want to be with you, I want to be back with you. He wants to be in this good place, right? Then the song goes on to find out that these two have a very tumultuous uh, relationship. It is, um, man, I don't know, it sounds bad vibes going on with them, very toxic, um, even in the scenery with them kind of shoving and pushing each other and fighting. Uh, but it is this time of year, and they're not in the jolliest of moods, it seems. So I want to take another little look at the lyrics um but man that felt like some heated intensity on top of a very christmasy song um and then at the end you have them kind of dancing once again i don't know if y'all get to see the video with me uh, but you kind of got them dancing at the end so maybe everything was all mended so it sounds like he's in the drunk tank and he's thinking back this is a song where he's looking through his memories they were young they kind of fell in love they were making big promises to, to each other he was handsome she was pretty life was looking good right looking down the pipeline they had a dream and it was all gonna happen right sinatra was swinging all the drunks they were singing i mean everything they kissed in a corner this started off so beautifully so yeah everything sounds like it started off so good um but then it, it turns bad later you're a bum you're a punk you're an old s on junk lying there almost dead on a drip in that bed um yeah they got they tore into each other later on in this song and you find out that their dreams didn't come true um they didn't build this great life together so i could have been someone well so could anyone you took my dreams from me when i first found you i kept them with me babe i put them with my own can't make it all alone i've built my dreams around you so this this is rough. It's a rough one, but hey, such is life. It's the fairy tale of New York, as they say, um, with the title of this song. So he's telling just of this story, man. Everybody's got big dreams. They're going to be a star. You're going to go far together. Look down the line, and boom, they're not in the best of moments. Uh, things didn't quite work out, and uh, there you go, man. It's I like that every Christmas song doesn't have to have... A happy story to it or a happy ending there is a christmas song for everybody it seems um and this is one that isn't the jolliest uh but regardless it's a christmas song and i like that i like variety i like options all right checking out this one we've got this one released in 1987 considered celtic rock celtic punk christmas okay written uh by jem finer and shane mcgowan okay song is four minutes 33 seconds long um so this is recorded by their london-based band the pogues uh, featuring english singer songwriter kirsty mccall on vocals the song is an irish folk style ballad and was written as a duet with the pogues singer 
McGowan taking the role of the main character and McCall playing the female character. It was originally released as a single on the 23rd of November 1987 and later featured on the Pogues 1988 album. It says, it originally begun in 1985, the song had a troubled two-year development history, undergoing rewrites and aborted attempts at recording, and losing its original female vocalist along the way, before finally being completed in 1987. Although the single has never been the UK Christmas number one, being kept at number two on its original release in 1987 by the Pet Shop Boys cover of Always On My Mind, it has proved enduringly popular, proved to be enduringly popular with the both uh, with both music critics and the public to date the song has reached the uk top 20 on 20 separate occasions since its original release yeah so you guys weren't lying this one is rather big it sounds like in the uk and the uk fairy tale of new york uh is the most played non-carol christmas song of the 21st century it is frequently cited as the best christmas song of all time in various television radio and magazine related polls in the uk and ireland including the uk television special on itv in december 2012 where it was voted the nation's favorite christmas song that is super interesting man to know i'm you know i'm only looking through american eyes man i'm here in america i know our christmas songs so i let you i told you guys i would let you know if i've ever heard this i have not ever heard this right after even the, on the intro of that i was like okay i've no i've not ever heard this and then the song completes yep couldn't tell you i haven't heard a note i haven't heard a chord i haven't heard a lyric from this song in my life uh so this was actually my first time hearing it in all of my life here living in america uh but to find out this has hit the top was the top 40 like 20 times since its release um that is pretty amazing man um the top 20 sorry not even the top 40 the top 20 in 20 separate occasions that is so cool uh, it just makes me think like how much more amazing like largely popular songs are there that I have no idea about being here right I was introduced to a band such as like Nightwish on this channel uh a band I hadn't ever heard of in my entire life and they those guys they put together some great music of guys and gal of course uh, they put together some great music but i hadn't ever heard it uh prior to this channel so man um and they're pretty popular in their region of the world so really cool man just makes you think you know uh it says although there is an arrangement among the band that fairy tale of new york was first written in 1985 the origins of the song are are sorry i said the range of my men agreement the origins of the song are disputed. McGowan insisted that it arose as a result of a wager made by the Pogues uh, producer at the time, Elvis Costello, that the band would not be able to write a Christmas hit single, while the Pogues manager, Frank Murray, has stated that it was originally his idea that the band should try to write a Christmas song as he thought it would be interesting. Banjo player Finder came up with the melody and the original concept for the song, which was sent to Sorry, which was set in County Clare on Ireland's west coast involving a sailor in New York City uh, looking out over the ocean and reminiscing about being back home in Ireland. Finer's wife, Marcia, did not like the original seafaring story and suggested new lyrics regarding a conversation between a couple at Christmas. Finer told NME, I had written two songs complete with tunes. One had a good tune and crap lyrics. The other had an idea for fairy tale but the tune was poxy i gave them both to shane and i and he gave it a broadway melody and there it was so really cool to see how that progressed from a seafaring tale um to a christmas song with mcgowan kind of finalizing it right with his twist on it man so you got the pogues right here this group came out in 1982 went till 1996 took a hiatus until 2001 and came back on the scene in 20 or sorry they uh started back in 2001 and ended in 2014 okay so 2014 was the last that you got to see of them looking at past members i see a name there that i have clicked on before and that is joe strummer man uh so he's right here involved with this group which is cool to see but i think that might be the only name on that list that i recognize um so at some point this man from the clash was involved with the pogues and maybe you guys can let me know exactly how that worked out uh these guys are out of king's cross london england and their genres uh are listed as celtic punk and folk punk all right so i want to thank you guys for the suggestion for getting me on onto this one now i've got another type of mood of christmas music i can listen to if i want to man so that's awesome thank you guys so much let me know if there's more from pogues or more christmas jingles that you guys want me to tune into i thank you guys every day for showing up and giving me 
great new suggestion so thank you for that if you enjoyed this reaction please let me know by liking subscribing and checking out the descriptions down below please consider becoming a member here on my youtube or patreon for as little as three bucks man it's a great way to keep the channel's wheels churning all right thank you guys so much and i'll see you on the next one peace